Welcome to A Word of Hope for Thursday of the fourth week of Easter. My name is Father Brendan Curran. Today we have a challenge in our gospel story of John. Jesus says, Amen, amen, I say to you, whoever receives the one I send receives me. Whoever receives the one I send receives me. Let us think about all the people we're in touch with. Let's think about all the people we work with. Do you see them as having received God's calling and sent to be around us? Or is it just about me? That oh, I'm baptized, I follow Christ, so Jesus must be calling just me, but the rest of the folks, whoever receives the one I send receives me. It reminds us of another important judgment story at the end of the Gospels as well. We know it well. You know, when, Master, did we ever see you hungry or thirsty or without a home? And Jesus said, whenever you did it to the least of my brothers and sisters, you did it to me. Whoever receives the one I send receives me, receives Jesus. That makes our whole world turned upside down. How do your coworkers show the sign of those being sent by Christ as well, being sent to us, your neighbors, your coworkers? It's a challenge in this Easter joy, in this Easter season. The joy comes when we reflect on how we receive others. Oh, we're very good about being sent in this gospel time of the resurrection. Oh, we arrive, uh, rise from the waters of baptism, and we're sent as messengers on the journey. But how about remembering that we are good Christians by receiving others and seeing the face of Christ as being sent to us in each of them? Oh, let that be our challenge and our own responsibility, and let that be a new word of hope for our world.